Hey there, welcome to the channel of learning physics in a practical way and uh, physics is going to be fun learning when you do it practically. Now in this today's video we shall see the magnetic field associated with a straight conductor and how to detect the direction. So you can see here there is a conductor bent uh, once here and the two ends of the conductor is connected to the battery and uh, a wire is connected here and the current passes from one end to the another end, it develops magnetic field around it. To test the magnetic field around this, we use magnetic needles, compass needles. These compass needles will deflect only when there is a magnetic field. So let me try uh, placing one compass needle close to this uh, conductor and uh, turning on the switch and the compass needle deflects. And if we place uh, four compass needle around it and uh, let us try this out. Now see the magnetic needles are all deflecting in a circular direction. It indicates that the magnetic field around a straight current carrying wire are circular in shape. But what about the direction of the magnetic field? We have a right hand grip rule or right hand thumb rule in order to detect the direction. This ampere right hand grip rule states that when we point our thumb of right hand in the direction of current, then the four fingers curl gives the direction of magnetic field. Now the magnetic field is developed around it and uh, let us assume the direction of current is vertically downward and I am pointing my thumb vertically downward. Now my four fingers curl gives the direction of magnetic field. That means clockwise direction. Now when I reverse the direction of current, now assume uh, the current is flowing vertically upward in this direction. Now the curled fingers are showing uh, the anti-clockwise direction. That means the magnetic field is anti-clockwise. We also can see the magnetic field around this part that is also a straight conductor, not vertically now. Now when I place the con compass needle just below it and turn on the switch, the current passes and you can see the deflection in the and also we can check the right hand thumb rule along this section of the conductor by pointing the thumb along the direction of current. Now you see the curled fingers are around. Now what would happen if I move the compass needle away? Now see the deflection has decreased, right? So as you move away from the conductor, what is happening? The magnetic field strength also decreases. Now the same ampere right hand rule can be used for detecting the direction of magnetic field along a coil. Now simply just reverse the directions in which you are doing earlier. So the magnetic field now is shown by thumb and the direction of current should be by the four fingers curled. If you curl your four fingers in the direction of current, then the thumb points in the direction of magnetic field. We just reverse the fingers direction. So here this is the rule applicable for coil and also the solenoid. 